good hello guys welcome to hill studios again and uh, it is a, it's a common problem that i am facing when i'm developing a mobile game is like whenever i'm pressing the button touch input is not working so for just better understanding i'll just uh, wait just keep it low and set the frame rate to more like 20 frames okay so in this slide i'll show you my blueprint so that you guys can understand whether you are facing the same problem or not demonstrate it right now so whenever we're pressing this particular thing i'm going to printing a string saying something like hello kind of stuff okay hello i think i already had it somewhere here wait even begin play multicast okay so if you consider this is a button this jump is like a button when i press this button the hello is not being printed on this side you can just observe because the input touch is not getting called when i'm pressing a button but what happens is sometimes you will have a fire button you just need to press the fire button and drag the screen in order to shoot the enemy what you guys need to do at this particular situation is to use image is to use image instead of uh, button okay so let us go to here okay i will tell you how to solve the particular issue go to player user interface and uh, go to player user interface and when you go to this player user interface you will then you can have any image you want i added this image and go to this particular position where you have on mouse button down it is like uh, when whenever we press a button you will have an input that is being called you just need to write that input here so i just showed my input what it is going to do is initially it's going to check like mouse press and it's going to set each fire into true and i'm going to call my firing function okay it is fine cool now i can press the mouse button like it means and i can also move my screen but how what about releasing right unfortunately there is no event uh, with respect to release like on mouse button release but i also have a quick fix for that so whenever you are going to have it input touch right there is also they're also going to be released so we can assume like okay it, there are two cases initially release is like okay you are normally releasing the button or you are just pressing an image and releasing the mouse right so what you guys, what you need to do is initially I'm going to send this release to a function which knows the on release. What this does is like it's just going to reset all of the variables. Here I'm setting, uh, wait, I'm going to show you guys. Here I'm setting e square into true, right? I'm going to reset e square into false. Even though it is set to false, I will set it. Not a problem for me. So it's like for i button, I'm going to set it to false. And again, e spiring button, I'm, I'm again going to set it to false. So from this particular portion, what you can get is like you can also get mouse button press and mouse button release, both of them, and you can also move your screen. Move your screen. Sorry for that, but uh, it almost took me entire. Like I'm, I'm, I want to find a solution. I'm posting everywhere in like uh, Discord everywhere. But uh, here is the solution, guys. I hope you guys can use this one. Thank you for watching the video.